to Almazra. Explore, secure intel, and loot to gain access to new missions. Enemy threat is high, so expect contact. Welcome back to some more Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2022 DMZ. As you can currently see, your boy has no weapons whatsoever. Besides my fists. But you know, sometimes you don't need to find a weapon. Sometimes you are a weapon. Ultra One, that intel confirms AQ has radioactive material in the area. We need to secure and extract that material. Locations are marked on your attack map. I left that part in there because I want y'all to see this. I didn't have to run around the entire building. I didn't even have to run around the entire building at all. There's a door right there. But anyways, we got this Gaga counter on us now, which means we should be able to acquire some fat cash from these caches. So why am I bringing you all this video? Mostly, it's because of Vito 1985. And if you don't know who that is, he's a uh, streamer. And he streams DMZ for hours on end, power to him, because I couldn't do it. Basically, he has learned a lot about this game, and he's telling me a lot about the game as well. So Vito, if you're watching this, shout out to you. I've taken what he's told me, and I said to myself, let me see if I can apply it to my own gameplay. And sure enough, what you're going to see in these next few moments is because of him. In a previous uh, deployment, he said that whenever you do a extract hostage contract, the timer doesn't start unless you open a door. In other words, you open a door, then boom, timer. But let's hold off on that thought for a minute. Yeah, I thought I was safe too, but I wasn't. Anyways, moving forward here, I'm going to try to use this buy station, right? And you see, I got a lot of stuff on me, and now I sell it. Or I had a lot of stuff on me, but I cut that out. So boom, one HCR, I get shot at once again, I turn around, and there's another AI hiding somewhere. Now he's gone. Okay, cool. Now... I'm going to put on his body armor and move forward with the commentary here. As I was saying, V-Dub has informed me that the timer don't start until you open a door. And if you get lucky enough, you can find windows to shoot through and lure the AI into your line of fire. Right? So I'm like, hmm, 
I wonder if it works for strongholds. To those of you, the dwindling few, who watch my vigor streams, all I'm going to say is, remember all those times that you see me approach a barred house and I look through it and I try to listen, I try to find somebody, and when I do find them, I wall bang them through a wall and it's a headshot. That's the same kind of concept here, except I didn't know it happened or it could happen until V-Dub showed me. But you know Call of Duty, it won't let you get away with it scot-free. All right then, area secure. Let's see if I can find another stronghold and hopefully it would have some better stuff for me, like a three plate armor vest. Marked on your jack map. Ultra one, the enemy is on high alert. Proceed with caution. Imagine finding a stronghold key card and a stronghold.
All right. I searched this house. There's no three-play armor vest here. Let's try to go for the final one. Activity is increasing near your location. Stay alert. Cash at a dead drop will fast track your weapon recovery. You know, I'm going to interrupt the flow of events here for a second. Call of Duty community. How do y'all feel about the FTAC recon? I've been seeing it a lot. And I haven't really used it all that often. But I can only assume it's a stop rifle. Because it says recon. So, how do y'all feel about that? Like, rate it on a scale of 1 to 10. And also give me a con. Not a pro, but a con of that weapon. In your honest opinion. I'd really appreciate it. And so, if time running out very quickly, I mean, 20 minutes goes by fast when you're actually having fun, I decided to go for this exfil. Yeah, I know, no uh, prisoner contract mission here because um, they're all too far away. And I want to get out of here before the final exfil approaches. So, we're going to do this. Be with you soon. Advised enemy operator secured a weapons case. Location is marked on your attack map. Ultra One, we have visual on the LZ. Keep it clear. That's odd. And I say it's odd because I think if I didn't have that self revive on me, even though I didn't use it, I wouldn't have escaped. 
So, I mean, look, I've seen people, or I see myself rather, get on a helicopter with no suffer vibe, but I'm in, a, I'm in a down state and I didn't survive, even though I was on a helicopter. So, I don't know. I'm still learning the game, but hey, now it's good to know that strongholds are easy. Very easy now. So what's next on my plate? Well, y'all know that uh, the final mission, no rushing, where we gotta kill AI and down three helicopters with a second 38, uh, MG38 or whatever. I'm on that mission right now. And the thing is, I have the machine gun unlocked, but a 150 round box. That's an attachment, an ammunition attachment, a level 16 ammunition attachment. And y'all know me, I don't like my light machine guns in this game, or any other game for that matter, besides the HCR-56, but that's not a light machine gun. So, I'm about to grind that weapon up, because I don't play Modern Warfare 2022, I just play DMZ. So, stay tuned, I'll see you next time. Peace.